Hi, I'm Rebecca from Little Adventure Shop and today I'm going to talk to you about these little guys, midge and mosquito head nets, um, what they are and why they should be an essential part of your trip kit. Okay, so it's a little pack here which contains a basically a head net which is basically a sack which has a really fine mesh. If I just put a bit of white paper behind you might be able to see. So the mesh is really really fine so the idea is this keeps the midges and mosquitoes on the outside and your head is kept away from being bitten. So the first time I was told to take one of these I was going on a little canoe expedition in the west of Scotland and I was a bit like oh yeah okay and I packed it it was right at the bottom of my kit bag and I was just like oh yeah I've got it I'll get it out when I need it. Um, when you need a midge net, you need it like 10 seconds ago. You don't want to be rooting through your um, kit to go and find it. So if you've, got, if you've been told to pack one, make sure you keep it at the top of your rucksack or somewhere or in your buoyancy aid pocket or somewhere you can just grab it and chuck it on. Because the thing, well certainly I've experienced with this um, midges on the west coast of Scotland is they're not there and then they are swarming around you and it's pretty grim to be honest. So when the midges land, you can either just pull this straight out of your little stuff sack and chuck it over your head or it is better if you've got a boony kind of style hat like this which has got a rim all the way around you just chuck your hat on and then it's really glamorous you <laughs> chuck this right over the top like that hopefully it's not dragging on my microphone um, and then there'll be a little draw cord here and you just pull it in again to stop the little biters getting in and up your neck so it just holds the mesh you can just turn to the side there you see it holds the mesh away from your face so you can still see them but they're not actually going to get in at you um oh i just need to take this off now you can also wear it with a, a cap you can chuck it over the top of a, like a baseball cap it's not quite as good because it doesn't give you the um the uh, sort of holding the mesh away at the back but it but it will do the same job pretty much so the other thing tip I'd say with traveling with kids again is one of those things like make them take responsibility for where their midge nets are or keep them all together with you in, in a one pocket so you can just grab four or five out in one go when the, when the midges descend. So yeah, they're really not very expensive but if you haven't got one you're seriously going to regret it if you get caught out in a midge attack. <laughs> um, so yeah, really simple, really useful, make sure you know where it is when you pack your kit hope that's helpful if you've got any more tips particularly any tips for keeping midges away please let me know because i'm one of those people that just gets bitten before everyone else um, let us know in the comments section below um, if you like the video please hit the like button and subscribe to our channel many thanks